you broke a 13 year streak of not smoking weed for an amazing reason. And yeah, this is a man. guest we've had on here. I was at the improv, uh, working on material. I do a show there often, uh, in, in Hollywood, 40 people, like very small audience when I'm working on like new material or whatever. And, uh, I walk in the comedy club and the staff runs up to me, Liz, and they, she comes up to me and she goes like, like she saw a goat and she's like, Paul, is here to see you. And I'm like, she was like, Paul McCartney. And I was like, who? The Beatles, Paul McCartney? She's like, yeah, yeah, he's downstairs. He's waiting on waiting on you to stop. She brought him up and it was him. And he was like, hey man, how, you, how are you, man? And yeah, man, I wanted to see you uh, get down tonight, man. You know, love your work, man. Love your specials and love everything. And I'm like, wow. And so we was just talking and then he goes, yeah, man, you mind if I partake? And he pulls out a joint, and I'm like, hell yeah, go ahead. And then he passes it to me, and I told him, I said, I haven't smoked in 13 years, man, but I have to smoke with you. I have to do it. And I smoked with him, and we sat there and smoked and talked about Michael Jackson. And then he goes downstairs, and I go down, and I had the worst show I ever had in 20 <laughs> years. Because I haven't smoked and performed and I don't know how long, so I bombed the entire hour. But he stayed. And as each joke didn't work, I could just hear very subtly in the back, I could just hear, huh. and it's just <laughs> like, <laughs> him laughing at my material not working. <laughs> and then I told people that I was high, but I didn't tell them why. And then at the end of my set, because I didn't want to use that as a crutch, at the end of my set, I brought him on stage and people gasped. They had no, it was like, yo. But he enjoyed that moment really a lot because it was a real moment and wasn't like praising him. And we didn't, we, we was just like, oh man, we on it. But also it's like, hey man, give me some motherfucking gum. You know, like <laughs> <laughs> he just loved a real moment. 